This is Moat Marine's aquaculture park right here, and this is where Project Snook is going on. Y'all come in and check this out. This is where all the magic happens with these snooks. Let's go check out these mogans in here. Each of these uh, tanks have either about 15 to 28 fish, depending on the ratios that we have of males to females. I'm Carol Neidig, staff scientist. I work for Moat Marine Laboratory. We're trying to replicate social behavior that would be seen in the wild to encourage them to spawn. Ooh, that's the sound I like. I'm Matthew Resley. I'm a senior biologist here at Modoc Culture Park. I'm in charge of all the adult fish. I'm in charge of getting them to, to spawn so that we can have the, the little guys that we're releasing in the wild. After the snook and spawn, this is where they bring the larvae and they raise them from little larvae up to fingerling size right before they're released. It's kind of like a nursery. I'm Nate Brennan and I'm in the Center for Fisheries Enhancement. At this point in time, I'm working on rearing the snook as larvae to raise them up to stages where we would actually be able to release them. This stage, they're kind of oceanic still. So. Yeah. So they're day 11 here. Project Snook is important to us because we're trying to understand how to better raise these fish and to get them out into the wild. So every dollar, even if it's one dollar, helps us to be able to make this happen. Is that awesome or what? And this is just the beginning of Project Snook. Anything you guys can do to help, it will greatly be appreciated, especially by these snook. Now back to the water.